morning to you all. This is today, Friday the 18th of November 2005. Another Friday for us. Hey, the week's gone really quickly. Yeah, it's gone very fast. I, I'd actually, I like Fridays. I mean, don't get me wrong, but I'd like to slow the world down a little bit. Would you? No, it should be Christmas in two days. I don't mind speeding it up on a Monday. <laughs> <laughs> we all have to just breathe and enjoy our lives, I think. I have you know? to catch we up on some sleep. Again. Oh, I know, you've had mm. a big week, I understand. It's a football, of course. All right, security. We were talking football yesterday. Today we're talking security. It'll be the focus of an Australian-American summit in Adelaide today. We'll speak to Foreign Minister Alexander Downer about his meeting with US Defence Secretary Donald Rumsfeld. Among many other things as well. Also this morning, has the nation become too addicted to antidepressants? Mm. And do those drugs do more harm than good? That's going to get everyone talking. Yeah, it will. We're going to speak to a psychiatrist who says it's not as simple as a chemical imbalance. And that's going to be a controversial view, I think. Mm. Plus the new trend in Christmas presents. Plastic surgery. How do you fit a facelift into your Christmas get shopping? Get out. I'm serious. That's what everyone's getting for Christmas. Do you know in LA before the um, Oscars, they have drive through plastic surgery? <laughs> Oh, is it drive-through Botox? It. One of the two. Anyway, I don't cool. know about the facelift drive-through. I'm sure the Bowie. I'm sure you could do the Bowie in the driveway. I'll supersize that. If you could supersize it. <laughs> get the whole body done. All right. We begin this morning with the latest news, though, with Sharon Goodell. Good morning to you, Sharon. Botox-free. Thank you very much, Carl. <laughs> morning, Trace. And good morning to everyone. Well, Australian citizen Vivian Alvarez will return home this morning four years after she was wrongly deported to the Philippines. 